वेलकम एवरी वन सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व अ वेरी नाइस प्रॉब्लम वेर वी नीड टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स ओके एंड ट्रस्ट मी इट इज एक्चुअली वेरी वेरी इजी टू डू इट ओके सो वील राइट डाउन आर क्वेश्चन वन मोर टाइम योर सो वी हैव एक्स माइनस टू डिवाइड बाई थ्री इक्वल्स टू फोर ओके सो नाउ नेक्स्ट स्टेप वॉट वी शुड डू इज फर्स्ट वील नीड टू इराडिकेट इराडिकेट द स्क्वेर रूट on both sides for that we'll take squares on both sides so that happens so your the lhs square root as well as the square cancel each other so now we have x minus 2 upon 3 equals to 16 4 square is 16 now next step what we should do is we need to get rid of this 3 first so we'll multiply both sides by 3 this and this will get cancelled so i'm left with what x minus 2 equals to 48 Last but the, not the least, to find the value of x, we need to add both sides by two. So I can say value of x comes out to be fifty. Now let's try and put it over here. Fifty minus two that gets you what? Forty-eight upon three under a root. So this is ones are and sixteens are. So now we know root sixteen. The answer is what four, which is the RHS given. Now please understand. Lot of people think that root sixteen can be plus or minus four. That's absolutely wrong. Root of a positive number will always, always be positive. If they had given us some x square value, which is what sixteen, then I can say value of x is plus minus four. If it is equal to a variable, yes, then the value can. Have positive as well as negative values, but if there is no variable, then you just need to find a root of a positive number. Then in that case, you have to get rid of this negative. It will always be positive. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.